Ever since Huawei got banned from getting access to Google Apps, it's been a problem for most Huawei users. And in today's video, I come bearing solutions with which you could finally download Google Apps right on your Huawei device. A few things you need to take notice of though. First off, you have to make sure you're using a Huawei device that has support for EMUI 14 and above. And if you don't have that, you need to make sure you're purchasing a device like that. An example is the Huawei Nova 13 Pro with which I'll be making a full review soon. There are two ways with which you could actually get Google services is running smoothly on your Huawei device. The first is to download the MicroG app right from the Huawei app gallery. Now, all you have to do is to go to the app gallery and then search for MicroG. You should see two applications that would be downloaded. Download both of them like you're seeing on the screen and then open them. When you open them, you'll be asked to log in with your Gmail account. Log in with a preferred Gmail account and that is it. Make sure most of the options are checked within the MicroG app and now you can go back to the app gallery. Right within the app gallery, search for your Google apps and you should be good to go. Download either of the apps you want could be Google Drive, Google Maps, or even Google Chrome. What will be required of you would be to just sign in with your Google account and you're ready to start using these apps again. The other one, which is the second me method on the other hand, is one that is not really recommended because it does have its own downsides. However, if you still want to go ahead with it, it's for you to download the Gbox app. After downloading the app, you should find the Google Play Store right in this application. But what happens is you can't do anything outside the app and everything would have to be within the Gbox app. So even if you want to use Google Play Store, you'd have to open the app to get access to Google Play Store, with which you can actually create a shortcut of the Google Play Store app and then start using it. But everything you download from the Play Store goes back into the Gbox and it means you can't can't use anything outside the Gbox app. And this is available to people with EMUI 12, 13 upwards. However, it has its own downsides again. And this involves the fact that sometimes it might not be functioning properly and might have some glitches here and there. So you should pay attention to that as well. But if this is a method you want to try out, you can still go ahead and do that. But now, right to do the app gallery, you shouldn't stress a lot to find your Google apps, your favorite Google apps. And thanks to Huawei and Micro G services for making this possible. This is the Huawei Nova 13 Pro, and this is an amazing device. Again, I'll be making a review about it pretty soon, so stay tuned for it. I'm Delpy, and as always, we could talk more, Charlie.